I read in the news that bounce houses are pretty dangerous for kids these days. Apparently injuries have risen in these air castles of fun. I remember when I used to play in those mattresses of air. I'd jump and fly up and down, laughing with the people around me. But then sometimes there'd be a bigger kid who wanted to play, and the entire bouncing surface leaned towards him. Without time to react, I'd be thrown to the side almost horizontal in the air and land on the ground. Of course, just because I was on the ground didn't mean that the fun had to stop for everyone else. So as they continued jumping up and down, I'd be trying my hardest to stand up. Each time I'd lift myself off the bouncing surface, a kid would land near me and launch me in the air again, only for me to end up on my stomach. Again and again, this process repeated itself until an adult could see that I was struggling, nearly crying from the feeling of hopelessness. Stop jumping, they'd say, and everyone would stop until I shamefully crawled out of the bounce house, upon which the jumping resumed. I don't know how many kids are supposed to be allowed in bounce houses at a time. I suppose it depends on the size of the house, but to have more than four or five kids is pretty chaotic. Thank goodness for the safety netting to keep kids from flying all over the place, although I've fallen out of bounce houses a few times through the doorway. These bounce houses are supposed to be fun. With the proper adult supervision, I'm sure they can go back to being safe and enjoyable for everyone. Just please, if you see a kid on the floor trying to get up, call stop and let the kid get up. That kid just might be me.